Hey, what's up everyone? This is AD Gaming and welcome back to the good business. And today, I'm gonna show you a gameplay from the new test server, the new remastered. This time, we have new robots, the behemoth, you see, the comio with ivory autovisor, and we have the mender, futuristic walker, ivory autovisor. I'm showing you the not me actually this is my brother recorded the gameplay because i wasn't being able to record the test server so my brother is the one that he's gonna play in this particular test server and i asked him to use the gameplay his footage and he agreed and let's go i'm gonna show you his gameplay this is my brother you see dark light wr on the top left corner of the screen okay and you will see, he told me that in the beginning, the first match, he was showing you the map, how it's, how it's look like. We Also, we have the valley map. This is the valley map, the mastered valley map. But I think they, we, I see there are some black, uh, you, you see the mountain, they are a little bit uh, darker. Okay, so maybe they, they, he did, not, they did not finish uh, design them. Okay. By the way, if you like the content here, don't forget to smash the like button and also subscribe to the channel. Also activate the bell icon so you won't miss anything from the good business we are in on this channel. And my brother uh, is always saying the dark side of the good business on his channel. Okay, this is... Uh, by, uh, by the way, I want to thank him because otherwise I would not be able to show you the gameplay from the remastered. And there we go. He's dropping the behemoth with the nucleon. This is a crazy setup. Maybe, you know, I don't have the behemoth on my own account. I would be happy to run the, to try the behemoth. Uh, we'll see. I don't know when I get it. Okay. But uh, I see. I think this, this is the ultra low definition. So it means this is the lowest quality. Okay, we are testing the, this time the lowest quality. This is his first batch, so that's this is the reason why uh, the robots they are going, <laughs> they are dead so quick. Okay, now is the Inquisitor. Also, we have the Viper, the corrosion power. You see. Okay, they have four caps. The target system, you see? He was targeting the behemoth and the target system was throwing him, you see? I guess, this time he was angry. <laughs> Again, look at that. Again, second time, in a row. Target system. <laughs> I think the target system is much worse in the remastered. I can tell you from what I've tested last week i don't know how is that here but i see there are less lags on the remaster but you see the target system is much worse than the live server so this is this is a thing that pixonic needs to needs to be aware the target system is much much worse on this remaster not this the remaster the remaster uh, the server every time i played on the remaster there were uh, uh, problems with the target system. Okay, it seems that the enemy team, they are not trying to push beacons and they are not trying to fight. <laughs> oh my god. The bulwark is very strong on this test server. Man, look at that. Look at this graphic of the bulwark. It's look awesome. Look at this, uh, this uh, green stuff there. <laughs> and the shield, the Aegis shield. It's amazing, amazing. Also, he told me that the LD player, the emulator, is doing uh, a little bit of problems, and he was recording this from the Mimo. This is why it looks much better. All right, personally, I prefer the Mimo, but on the live server, Mimo is crashing most of the time, most of the time, all the time. <laughs> LD player is the emulator that works for me at least much much better than the others. Blue, blue stacks is not even an option, you know. 
it's not even working you are starting the gameplay and then crashing instantly and also we have the Nox some people told me that Nox uh, work, works for them but for me it's not working and uh, this LD player this is the one that uh, works for me and I'm running this but not here this is my brother here running Mimo Mimo emulator okay and they are gonna win this match it's, this is gonna be a quick match let's see how much my brother did they got a victory and let's see the tail of the tapes let's see you see the the screen the there are so much time until it reloads you see this is a lot of time okay five hundred thousand million <laughs> five hundred thousand two kills one beacon and directly we are going directly to the second match this is the mender look at his walking animation they are also changing the walking animation for some particular robots they also for the specter for example i know they are they are doing it uh, differently than other times you see the walking animation it's not like the live server the Mender, I have to say, also looks like, uh, you know, from the space, space, robot from the space, you know, a healer from space. But you see, he's not gonna survive here. The Bulwark is, it seems that the Bulwark is the strongest one in this, on this test server, with his Aegis shield and physical shield. So, this is very, very difficult to engage here, the Bulwark. Every time my brother is trying to engage, here, maybe the Inquisitor is the one that can fight versus the bul Bulwark. But he is back off, you see? <laughs> what is he doing? Turning around. I think he should be able to kill him with the Corrosion. Let's see. But the Inquisitor, the problem is with the Inquisitor. As soon as you, are, you jump, the stealth is wearing off. You are, uh, you are dead, basically. This is uh, what happened to my brother again. He's gonna bring the tank now, the bulwark. Let's see how well he's gonna do. He's gonna take the take out the behemoth. Okay. The Viper also. Look at the Viper animation. It looks amazing. Oh, we have we had a little bit of lag. Okay. Okay. He's trying to target in uh, the mender there, but uh, he needs to reload here. This is what he's what he is doing and right now eight seconds okay there is a jumping inquisitor you can target him this is what he is doing he's also a smart player my brother he told me that he wasn't that serious on this test server you know also me when I'm playing on the test server we are not playing serious you know this is not the real deal. This is also this is only for fun, you know. To have some fun, to show you the new stuff, what is in the test server. Okay. So take that in note. There is a big juicy spider. Look at that with the corrosion power. I like the corrosion power. I have Viper on my own account as well. I'm using them. Sorry, time to time. I really like them. I attend to run nowadays uh, something else like Redeemer and Nucleon. My Nucleon is almost up to par. I'm gonna use them maybe on my next live stream on Tuesday. Uh, today. <laughs> today. It's gonna be released today. So there is gonna be a live stream today. So stay tuned. There's gonna be a special live stream. You should stay tuned for today. Okay. So make sure to subscribe. Turn the notification bell. Don't miss this. They are gonna win this match as well, so I'm gonna do the conclusion. For what I've seen here, what I see here, the graphic looks cool. Uh, I cannot see much lags, there are not uh, much of a lags. But the target system, I can see the target system is a little bit messed up, okay? So if it's on it, I don't know if you will watch this video or not, or people, tell me, let me know, what do you think? I think the target system is a little bit uh, not so good. I can see it. 
My brother was trying to target somebody with an Inquisitor twice in a row and he lost the target. And this is something that... And also the Inquisitor, it seems that the Inquisitor doesn't have the uh, stealth, you see. The stealth ability of the Inquisitor is this is not working. So this is the reason why they got my brother so easily with the, when he used the Inquisitor. The stealth ability of the Inquisitor is not working, you see it. He was targeting him with the Bulwark. Okay. So you see, this is a test server. This is always... a. This is one of the reasons why I'm not uh, recording videos from the test server. Because, you see, there are a lot of bugs and stuff like that. Uh, you know, you cannot judge by numbers. You cannot say uh, but, uh, uh, about uh, something like uh, also the flamethrowers. Many, many people said that they nerfed the flamethrower, but I did not say nothing because I know the test server, there are a lot of bugs and stuff like that. So this is the reason why I, I did not say anything, okay? When it come to the live server, only then you can judge and you tell the, the, the things. Okay, uh, let me know uh, what do you think uh, in the comment section below. And before I sign off, I want to say special thanks to my members and Patreon on my channel. Thank you for your contribution and support in the channel. And if you want to join, make sure to do it in the link in the, link in the description below for the Patreon and the, the Patreon. And the member, you can see it if you are, uh, you know, logging into youtube and you, you you see it and next to my next to my name ad gaming next to the subscription tab okay and also by joining the patreon you gaining access to a discord server for patreon and members only which you can talk to me directly okay and you sometimes when i have secrets you uh, the patreon and the member they are the first to know about this kind of stuff okay and also we have official discord server for all you can join it make sure to do it also the link in the description below and if you like the content here make sure to smash the like button not the phone and subscribe to the channel also activate the bell icon so you won't miss anything from the good business we are running on this channel and as always have a good day slash night